But I, I guess I disagree with the idea of, the, of you know the label of these people being trophy hunters because they're they're not they're not proud to say that here's this wolf I've mounted because of the animal's beauty. They're proud because they've killed something that they hate. Uh, tonight we had a pretty good turnout of students and community members that came. I gave a short presentation on wildlife management and kind of the ecological side of the wolf hunt. Uh, I'm Adam Magnuson. I'm with the Earth Keepers 2 student team along with Caitlin Bigner and uh, Tom Merkel. As the co-president of the Native American Student Association, we feel that it's important um, to have this referendum. And we're uh, hosting this event with the Native American Students Association. I, I'm a citizen of the Sault Ste. Marie tribe of Chippewa Indians, and so is Hannah, my co-president. A protected species because traditionally it's a very sacred animal and it's not supposed to be hunted, so it just coincides with my traditional <laughs> values to try and protect the wolves. I talk about trophy hunting, but I think trophy hunting is trophy hunting for polar bears and rhinos and elephants and things like that. I, this is hatred. People want to shoot wolves because they're in direct competition for something that they're looking for, and whether that's deer or freedom, you know, I don't know what it is. Um, and then Amanda talked briefly about um, the myth of, that the Native American tribes share about their creation story and the importance of the wolf in their lives. The wolves are important to tribal people, especially the Anishinaabe. What wolves mean to the Native American tribes? He was given the wolf. The stress of a wolf hunt, you know. You guys hired here to sign? We are. Awesome, we'll take you. <laughs> he went to get you do the Great Spirit. The timber wolves of Wisconsin and northern Michigan. The wolf, Mayingan. population of wolves in Michigan is 687. The recovering population, they were just taken off the endangered species list. We've already destroyed wolf populations in the past and now they're making a rebound and the populations are still pretty low. Well, wolves are very important to the ecosystem. Of the first man, he was lonely and he requested a companion. We caused more harm to them than they ever have to us. Two thirds of all wolf deaths are inflicted by humans. The wildlife management and ecological side of uh, the wolf hunts. In the UP, mm -hmm. where are the major wolf packs? Espresso, earth keepers feel about that. As an earth keeper, one of the things we said that we're going to do is stand with the native tribes up here. And the wolf is one of their religious symbols and we have to protect that. Wolves, they're a vital aspect to the ecosystem in the UP. They've been here before for a long time and they're really only just established firmly now. We had uh, signatures on the petitions and then we showed a movie of the timber wolves of Wisconsin and northern Michigan. But if we keep uh, on the pace that we're at, we're in good shape to get there. I see humans as kind of a species who likes to destroy things and, and feel we have some dominance over everything else. It just makes me really sad. It's distressing. Like these wolves have no idea what's being, what their fate's being decided in some legislative chamber. I think wolves are more of like a sport hunting thing. Very little scientific understanding and it really made me sad. I think wolves are a special animal. Wolves are worth protecting. Stop and think. Uh, about these wolves. Because there's no wolves left, pretty much. Still stay connected and they would live parallel lives. So we have to keep our wolf population healthy. Yeah, well it has been. Well, it's been a lot of uh, petition gathering events as well as kind of educational events. Um, my goal personally as a coordinator for the UP was to kind of take this uh, out as far as I could throughout the Upper Peninsula. Universities, uh, public libraries, businesses that are involved, you know, that will let us kind of set up a table and do those things. And if anybody needs petitions, I've got a big stack of them, so um, my email is admagnus at nmu.edu. Uh, so find me and I'll give you some petitions. And I'd love to have your participation in uh, the anti-wolf anti -wolf hunt.